snub. Meg and Harry to spend lonely Christmas with Eugenia's traitors are not wanted by Cambridge's. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle may choose to spend Christmas with Princess Eugenie, if a UK visit is on the cards for the couple. Eugenie, the 31st of May host her cousin Harry and his family over the festive period if the Sussexes return to the UK. Despite Harry, 37, and wife Meghan, 40, moving to California after Megxit last year, they are reportedly still close with Eugenie. Harry and Eugenie's close-knit bond is said to extend back to when they were children, and has grown stronger to date. During the royal cousin's childhood, their mothers Princess Diana and Sarah Ferguson were close friends who spent a lot of time together and often their children tagged along on outings and holidays together. Harry and Eugenie's friendship was cemented further following their frequent visits to the London club scene together, including one tropical island-themed club called Mahiki which Eugenie's husband Jack Brooks Bank used to manage. The royals could also bond over the birth of their children, as both families welcomed a child to their midst in 2021. There is mounting speculation that the Sussexes may return to UK soil over Christmas, and they could stay with Eugenie's family for the occasion. Meanwhile, Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle are unlikely to stay under the same roof as the Cambridges if they visit the UK for Christmas. Meghan and Harry have not been back to Britain as a family unit since 2019 and the Queen still hasn't met their daughter Lilibet who was born in June. The couple left royal duties behind in early 2020, and purchased a mansion in Montecito, California where they reside with two-year-old Archie, and four-month-old Lilibet. Since then, the Duke of Sussex has only returned to the UK on two occasions, but never with the rest of the family in tow. Harry has briefly returned to attend the funeral for his grandfather Prince Philip, who died in April aged 99, and also he unveiled a statue honouring his late mother Diana, Princess of Wales with brother Prince William in July. The potential trip would mark the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's joint visit to Britain since stepping away from the monarchy in 2020. The couple abdicated from duties within the royal family, before moving to the US to pursue a financially independent lifestyle. The Sussexes currently reside in Montecito, California with their two children Archie, aged two and baby Lilibet, born in June. Royal baby Lilibet Diana marks the 11th great-grandchild for Queen Elizabeth II, whom she is named after. Following their move to the US, Meghan and Harry have not returned to UK soil together meaning members of the royal family have yet to meet the latest addition to their family. Among those is Harry's cousin Eugenie whom the couple share a close relationship with. Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson's youngest daughter is currently living in Harry and Meghan's former home Frogmore Cottage. Eugenie, alongside her husband Jack and baby son August, are currently staying at the property formerly belonging to her cousin Harry. The couple, who welcomed their baby in February, have been living at the Windsor Pad since December last year. If the Duke and Duchess of Sussex do decide to visit the UK, they could stay at their former property alongside Eugenie. The home which forms part of the Crown Estate, the monarch's public estate in Windsor, boasts four bedrooms and a nursery meaning there's plenty of room for guests. Following their departure from the firm, the Duke of Sussex has only returned to the UK on two occasions, but never with the rest of the family in tow. Harry briefly returned to attend the funeral for his grandfather Prince Philip, who died in April aged 99, and also unveiled a statue honouring his late mother Diana, Princess of Wales with his brother Prince William in July. During Harry's visit for the funeral of his grandfather he completed his travel quarantine at the cottage, so speculation has arisen that the family would choose the property to stay at again.